welcome back and before we jump into the next episode I just wanted to give you a quick update on the fiberglass roof. Now you saw from last episode I was really excited, we'd solved all of the mushrooming problems that we had and unfortunately when we've come back to the boat the inside of the roof has started to sag down again. The reason we put those poles in the beginning is because I'm watching the dog. <laughs> The reason that we put those wooden poles at the top was for strengthening the roof. That is the most important thing and so that we have still achieved that. However, underneath we're going to need to come up with new plans as to push the roof up a little. P.S. We've got 100 plus subscribers now on YouTube which is really exciting. What started off as something just to sort of make for our family has grown into 100 subscribers which for me is super exciting i don't even know 100 people so yeah thanks for watching and enjoy the episode welcome back it is day six of renovating our wilderness beaver enjoy I actually got some primer on the rubber so Victor decided to paint over it with some black spray paint. Hilarious. I'm degreasing the boat here just making sure that it's all ready to put the paint on. So like a last minute dust and degrease. Victor thought he'd be able to lift off the outboard engine but it was attached on and too heavy. We covered the boat with some paper. A wee bit more masking tape to keep the paper in place. It's like we're wrapping up a big Christmas present. Final dust and degrease before we start painting the hull. Exciting! Hey! We decided on a polyurethane two pack top coat. That meant that we have to have some paint plus some hardener and because we decided to use a spray gun we also had to mix in some thinner so it was like one big science experiment
to paint. Don't know if you noticed that, but I jumped when the compressor made a noise. Which happened all of the time. Every time the compressor made a noise, I jumped. So you can see the colour that we have chosen. We went for a satin finish. We really love this colour because, I mean, is it grey? Is it green? Is it blue? Is it primer? We just don't know. I thought to take a really cool shot here with Victor not in focus, but um, I ended up getting paint on the camera lens for real this time. Just to show you a walk around off before, so this is before fully primed hull of our wilderness beaver, smooth to the touch and here is after. So you can see this lovely finish on the hull, it's not shiny but it's not not shiny either. So thank you so much for watching this episode, it was really exciting to paint the hull. Please do give us a like and subscribe to this channel if you're enjoying our journey so far. Next episode is coming out soon and really looking forward to seeing you then. And here's a crazy dog. <laughs> <laughs>